Good morning. Good morning. We're going to Moldova today. And I don't know if there'll be internet there. So if you're seeing this, it means I found internet somewhere to upload it. <laughs> Everyone ready to go to Moldova? Yep. Yep. Yes. Okay guys, going to Moldova. Hi. Here we go. Okay guys, we made it to the border. This is the border of, it's called Stare Kazace. It is the border crossing into Moldova. It's about an hour, a little over an hour from our place, from Odessa. And so, as you can see, there's a lot of trucks here and the road. Oh, is that truck gonna make it by us? Wow, that's really close. Oh no, he can make it by. He can't make it by. There was another car over there. He made it by. Anyway, they don't. They don't have this set up really well for the cars to be parked here. But usually the cars are on the left and the trucks are on the right, and then they make a lane down the middle for people coming the other direction. But. Um, so there's a decent line here. You can see the line up there. But hopefully it's moving fast and then I don't know, I'm guessing maybe 45 minutes we can get through, maybe an hour. And then once we go through that crossing up there, then we drive about 200 yards or so, 300. And then there's the entrance into Moldova and then you have to go through the uh, passport control there. So. Yeah, I see. We're, we are moving here, so we're making a little progress. There we go. Christina went to... Um, Christina went to get uh, insurance, road international insurance for the van because you have to get that across the border they have these little places that sell it right here before you go across the border so hopefully she'll make it back before we get to the uh, passport control here Let's see. side and we're just waiting for them to return our passports here on the Moldovan side and then we'll be free in Moldova and on our way to the conference but it's hot so we're looking forward to getting back on the road and turning the AC on This road actually is good 
Actually, in general, my experience has been a lot of the roads are better in Moldova than they are in Ukraine. Although, they say Moldova is a poorer country than, than Ukraine is, but not in the sense of roads, I guess. And it's probably easier to fix roads in a smaller country <laughs> than fix roads in a, big, in a big country. But we definitely enjoy better roads here. But the speed limit is 90 kilometers an hour here. And the car that's behind us with some of our friends in it, like a couple of miles after they got into Moldova, they got stopped by the police. Because we're not used to going that slow, 90 kilometers an hour. It's like what? It's like 50, right? This Usually roads like this, we're used to going like 70, 75. And trying to keep it down to 50 is, is a little bit unusual. Okay guys, we made it to the camp here. It's along the Nista River, Moldova. So, it's pretty warm. <laughs> kids are kids are playing and getting we're just waiting for dinner. Everyone's really hungry. Picked up some friends in Kishinev on the way here. And this is where we're going to be spending the next 4 days or so and meeting with our team members and um, planning for ministry.